So that's two wins out of two for Arsenal. Of course, as it is for the defending champions, Manchester City as well, who are looking to bolster their squad. And reports are suggesting they're going to go to France to do that. Uh, Jeremy Doku uh, to make a 60 million euro move from France. Tell us about him, Jules. Very exciting winger. If you're a City fan, amazing talent. There's no doubt on the talent. He was a, a prodigious player, very young at Anderlecht in Belgium. He's a Belgian international now. Uh, Rennes brought him at the club three years ago for 26 million euros. So they've, the value has doubled up in the last three years, despite him lacking a lot of consistency. He's an amazing talent in terms of skill set. The dribbling is amazing. The pace is fantastic. But the end product is, is missing too often, really. And if you look at the stats in terms of goals and assists, it's nowhere near where it should be or should have been at Rennes. And that's only in Ligue 1. In a, in a team like Rennes that, that plays good football, that is a very attacking team, not like a super defensive team where he, he would not have much of the chance to show what he can do with the ball. They're very different. They're a very attacking side. So the numbers should have been better than that, higher up than that. He's had injuries, especially in his hamstring, because I think of the... That pace, that incredible pace that he has. So that is something the injuries to, to keep an eye on. And the rest, if, if Pep, and you would expect that Pep can, because he's Pep, can get him into a more consistent player, especially the final product, what he does, assist, scoring, the shots, the crosses, all of that, then they've got a wonderful player on their hand because he, he has a great future ahead of him if he can get that right. Because the rest, the, the, again, the dribbling, the pace, all of that is, is wonderful to have. And this is someone that they could use on that right-hand side. This is his best position. This is where he likes to play, even if he's right-footed. He loves being, being on that right-hand side. So it makes sense, even if you can think 60 million for still such a young player who hasn't shown much, who's never played in the Champions League, for example, or very little in Europe. This is a lot of money, but I think there's a potential there that if you unlock completely, and, and fulfill, then he's going to be an amazing player for you. Thanks so much for watching ESPN on YouTube. And for more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for premium content and live streaming, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.